DJ 1079. Ottawa's new music, Global Hip Hop Baby. You're not rocking with Ricky P. What's going on? It's T Dot. I'm Sarah. Sidekick. And uh, yeah, we got a special guest in the building. State your name, bruh. Bands of make good things. <laughs> Bands of <laughs> Castro Crosby. What up, y'all? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? Man, Pittsburgh to the Parliament. What? GTP. What's that all about, man? What do you mean, man? It's, it's, <laughs> it's the team. Like it's everything. You know, we've been running with that motto for a minute since like I met uh, when I met Sweet Squeezy. Mm-hmm. And uh, a lot of homies out there, fast our homies. Shouts to Crooked Logic too. So, so um, how did you come with that 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 that, that uh, motto? Like, I um, well, you know, first of all, what up, Otto? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm happy to be here. I've been, you know, Ricky and T. Dot. They've been asking me to come up here and do this for a minute, and I've just been waiting until that album was done. So it's done. It comes out next week. So that's cool. Uh-huh. And um, but yo, PTP. That started like just how everything else is. You know, quick idea. Triple B, that was best of both borders. That was when me, me and Mez, when we didn't even really like have the whole team. It was just me, Mercs, and Mez. Uh, Noah Mays, you know, he's doing this thing out in Toronto and stuff. We used to all rap together. It was just Triple B Project. Mm-hmm. And then when I started making my solo joint, we started Triple B, the whole like you know company. And um, PTP, Pittsburgh to the Parliament. That's what I represent. That's all I know for real. So. Just keep that in it, you know? <laughs> so, you know, for the people that don't know, you know, because you're from Pittsburgh and yeah. came to Ottawa, like, can you, you know, tell your tell your story to the people? All right. Well, I'm from Pittsburgh originally. I'm a Pittsburgh native. I lived there for 17 years, you know, went to high school, graduated, dated girls there, and all, <laughs> all, all that cool stuff. And, um, I, oh, yeah, I used to be a backup dancer in Soul For Real, too. When, no way. No, I'm joking. <laughs> that was just, like, my dream job, you know. I, if I was on the radio, I always wanted to say it. No, but, um, man, you know, um, I've been in Ottawa back and forth since then, like, for five, four or five years, five, six years. I went to New York for, like, a year, but I came back, did some schooling, you know. I'm only 23, so I got a, little, a lot of things to do. Weren't you out of Montreal, too? Uh, yeah, I went to Montreal for six months. That was like the first time I ever came to Canada. I went to the Concordia for six months, and um, I had a scholarship because I'm, I'm smart. I'm not like a stupid rapper. <laughs> true, true. And um, yeah, so I did that, and the school thing didn't work out. I didn't have like 20 racks to pay that year. The school, I was like 18, so I didn't have that. So I just moved to Ottawa. My pops was like gracious enough to just let me, you know, do what I do here, and I didn't have to go all the way back home. So it was sick. And then Ottawa liked me, too. Like, they loved me. They showed me mad love. You know, I always say that Ottawa didn't have to like me. I could have came here and started doing what I did and, like, got no shows or, like, <laughs> nothing. You know what I mean? So that was sick. But, you know, got family here now, too. Okay, okay. Yeah. So who are some of the cats that you're rolling with right now? Yeah. Okay. Um, like I said, so for real. No, I'm just, <laughs> Triple B in general, like, right now, we, we rebuild it. At first, it was just, like, you know... Me, me and my, uh, like, you know, family members and, like, superiors, like, OGs. Uh, now it was me, Mez. Uh, I got Rowan Flowers is, like, the head CEO's type still. He's CEO on paper, but me and Red Mez, we really run that, you know what I mean? But, <laughs> but you know what I mean? He does, he, he writes books. He, he got two books and chapters right now. It's not just about music, you know. That's where the best of both borders thing came from, you know. We wanted to do just more than music. We got producers. Victor Northstar is an artist slash producer. Artist first. He's, like, three album. He got three joints on my new album that's coming out. Oh. Um, like I said, City Fidelia is the newest member of the like, team, for real, for real. We didn't announce it yet because we're doing like a Triple B compilation, Uh-oh. and we're just trying to do songs for it okay. first. I, yeah. got, I got I got a joint from him tonight. I, I was yeah. talking to him earlier, so I got a joint. We're going to play it. Yeah, we, we got, you know what I mean, though? We're just trying, trying to do, do the songs first, and then like, you know, start yeah. promoting it as the whole team thing. But yeah. City Fidelia self-made. His project's killing right now. Um, Skin Deep from Montreal. Um, you know, and just a whole bunch of like businessy people, you know what I mean, that do what they gotta do in their lane. You know, everyone's not a rapper. I'm pretty much, I was like the only rapper at one point. Now we got Vic, City, and oh, Squeezy too. Squeezy Triple B now too. Oh, yeah, you that's know. fam right there. That's yeah, Squeezy's right Triple there, B too now, for real, for real. He's always been Triple B. We've done tapes in a million times, but when his next project drops, it will be a Triple B project. So now, um, me, I first got. Uh, 
I got notice. I noticed from uh, Clara. Shout out to Clara Calderon. You know, she she's the one who put me on. Swag. You know, my homie. Yeah. Um, Kinky. You yeah. know. <laughs> Um, so you first you went from you went from Castro to Castro Crosby like why why the names uh, change? Yeah, well you know um, it was just like it wasn't a name change it was just growing really you know what I mean because I well I did when I did the Crosby show right. that was my first tape ever you yeah, know what I mean so I did that it was called the Crosby show not the Cosby but it was concepted off of like Bill Cosby and being a rookie in the game which is Sidney Crosby because right. he's from Pittsburgh well no he's not from Pittsburgh he's from Canada plays for Pittsburgh right. at the time I was from Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh playing for Canada. So I was like, yo, that's a sick concept, but no one was really digging <laughs> yeah. it, you know what I mean? Ah. And then it dropped, but it, it did well, and um, Skinny Nigga, Skinny Boop, Toothpick, and um, that song did, like, great numbers. I think it got, like, 10, 20,000 downloads on online and stuff so far Major. till this day, which is crazy. Major. Because I never, you know, I never thought it was going to be that big. I never really, like, you know, took this, like, rap serious, serious, and then, like, when I seen, like, people listening to the music and that's when I really start taking it serious. Yeah, man. So you, you brought us an exclusive today, right? Yeah, I brought two right now. And I'm a rap, obviously. You know, you got you got you got to rap if you nah, come you, to the booth. You should have saved that, man. Uh, I, no, yeah. no, I'm just saying in general. You know, there's a lot of rappers in Ottawa, and if any rappers is playing, I just want y'all to know I rap all, t- all the time. So you know, <laughs> that, that's what the main part is, right? So I'm up here. So so this new joint, tell the people what it is. We going with the. Cool. Yeah, we're going with uh, Vicks. Vicks joint, right? Yeah. All right, cool. So the first joint we're going to play tonight is off of No Kids, No Felonies, which is my new album coming out October 23rd, which is seven days from now, which is amazing. I can't believe I'm done with it. And uh, NKNF is like, if you ever see me on Twitter, Facebook, all of that, you're going to see NKNF because it really isn't about having no kids, no felonies. That's that first. That's the first thing. That's my situation. You know what I mean. That's why the album is. It's my album. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Right, right. No kids, no felonies. That's the concept my mom always told me. If if I wanted that, I could be like Bill Gates. You know what I'm saying. Be a millionaire. Get to where I want to go. And Fidel is the first video we're gonna drop off of this in a couple weeks. Nice. Vic, you know, Vic. It's self-explanatory. Very militant. All black Fidel rap. Triple B, man. Dope. Shouts so let's to get Vic, into man. it, man. Mezzy, what up, man? You, Here you it is. Cash underweather. Fidel. Mezzy underweather at the crib, too. Uh, Shouts to Mez. Shouts to Mez, man. I hope you're listening in right now. I know you're listening in. All day. <laughs> 